I looked out and I saw this weird contraption. everybody happy Tuesday it's T-Mobile Tuesday it's two dollar Duncan credit for you guys <laughs> who have T-Mobile Tuesday if y'all need to know uh, I just got off of work it's about five o'clock I'm tired got PJ out here he was playing Fortnite did you what are you doing the shop to refresh. The shop to refresh. Then there might be Star Wars things, so. I heard you getting very excited over Star Wars, like some, uh, what was it, lightsabers that you got or something? Huh. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Which, uh, three of them. which, <laughs> which, star, which, uh, lightsabers did you get? Kylo Ren's. Uh, is that red? Uh, Obi Wan's. Is that blue? Oh. Luke Skywalker. Green? Yeah. And Mace. Windu? So One Windu, oh, I think. Windu. That's purple? Yeah. Cool, dude. I heard, I heard you all the way from the room while I was working. So anyways, I'm going to get dinner started. I'm so proud of us. We've actually been going through a lot of our leftovers. Um, except for Power. Power doesn't... I mean, he did eat some leftover curry. Okay, okay. I'll give him credit for that. He did eat some leftover curry earlier today and I've been trying to finish up like just random you know leftovers from the past few days and we've been doing okay I asked the boys what they wanted today um, but I already had something in mind so I took out some frozen pho broth you guessed it we're having pho it's gonna be super quick to put together. It's basically heat up the broth, um, cook the noodles, which only takes like 30 seconds to cook in hot water. And then I'm pretty sure I have some frozen beef balls too. I'll have to look for that, but I'm pretty, pretty sure I, sh I have something here. And if not, that's okay too, because the boys actually do like pho without meat. Like they're perfectly fine with that. And then I have the garnishes, which is like cilantro green onions, and then I also bought a little bit of um, bean sprouts. This is so funny, right? You can just like get as much as you want. This cost me 24 cents. I'd much rather just do that. Nice. Instead of buying a whole package of bean sprouts, because I never, I not never, but I hardly finish a whole package of bean sprouts. It's a lot. And usually it's like a dollar, dollar something for per package. So anyways, yep, that's for dinner. Um, Power, when he came home today, he came home with Ming Chick. So his dinner's taken care of. He's already eaten. I don't know, that that guy, he, <laughs> I mean, I get it. Ming Chick is like his favorite, one of his favorite foods. And so whenever he sees like a deal on it, he has to go get it. So, and I'm kind of like, oh, save money, eat at home, eat leftovers. That's where we differ. Okay, let me make the noodles. Oh, and then over here, I washed a bunch of strawberries. Where's Dad? He wants to go drop off a package. Oh, that's the strawberries. I'm gonna make, I think I'm gonna try to make chocolate covered strawberries today. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I was trying to tell you guys. Thinking about making chocolate covered strawberries after dinner. Um, so I washed them and they're just kind of like drying out here now. Because we still do have quite a bit of uh, our huge chocolate bar, so still trying to work through that. Don't want to waste, you know? Don't want to waste. I remember telling Power like I don't know, like a week or two ago, like I must be the most frugal person that I know, but not really, because I know other people that are frugal like me too. <laughs> but like, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I just really like to not waste things especially food um, especially because all the prices are so high right now I just don't want I just don't like food to go to waste I just really really don't like that so I want to eat through whatever we have in the fridge or the pantry or the freezer 
as much as possible. And I was digging in here for like 10 minutes and I still couldn't find the package of beef balls that I'm thinking about, but I did find these ones, which is perfectly fine. It's not the ones that I remember having, but I don't know, I can't find the other ones. Anyways, that's totally fine, like I said. But since I found these ones, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna utilize these. Who knows how long it's been in the freezer. <laughs> It was like way deep in there. All right, noodles are done. Got them in the bowl before they started sticking. Um, I'm gonna chop up some fresh cilantro and green onions. These came from my mom's garden. Perfect garnish to this pho dish. And then I think I'm gonna also add in some um, of the sugar peas. I They taste really good with the pho. Once I added them because we had no bean sprouts and I just thought I needed something kind of like like a vegetable crunchy thing in my noodles and actually it was really really delicious so I think I'm gonna add that and I'm gonna rinse this oh and I had to move the strawberries because <laughs> I only have one big strainer like this which I needed for the noodles okay let me move everything over move over okay bowl. Already got all the fixings in there. Oh yeah, this looks delicious. Man, PJ got like a man-sized bowl of pho over there. No, I didn't even use the big bowl this time. Sorry, that's a lot of pho. How is it, PJ? Delicious? Delicious! PJ said delicious is an understatement. That's how good mom's pho is. Some people be paying like $12 a bowl for a for a pho like that, you know? And you get it for free. Mom doesn't. <laughs> she gets it cheaper than $12 a bowl. And I got some main chick, cause I don't eat pho. <laughs> you didn't even know we were having fun today. Yeah, I got too hungry. Plus there's like a DoorDash 75% off. I'm like, dude, if I can get main chick for regular price without having to pick it up, I'm always gonna do that, okay? So. Boys are outside playing now. Let me move my plant. Where's your where's BJ? Power's making PJ earn something that he either bought on Fortnite or that he's gonna buy him on Fortnite and so he's making him earn it through playing basketball or doing some drills or something like that. But this is what PJ wants too. He, he does want to play but he wants like, he always wants power to like incentivize something for him. <laughs> Like, even when he goes out there, he wants Power out there doing it with him. He doesn't really like to play by himself. Even if it's just like retrieving the ball, he, he, like, he likes to have to Power out there. Now Uriah went out there. Are you looking at my plants, Uriah? How's my blackberry bush looking? You don't know? I don't know either. Don't touch, okay? <sighs> I'm gonna get all my plants ready to get into the ground, but I haven't had the time <sighs> to do it. Well, I need to still till up the ground. I probably need some more soil too. And we still need to dig up like all these big roots from the big tree that we had before. Yeah, if I can hire that guy again, maybe I should, huh? 
maybe it'll get done faster. Ah, yes. So, my plans. I'm sure my mom's gonna scold me after she sees this. Because she gave me a bunch of, like, zucchini and cucumber. Ay, Uriah! Pull. Oh, my goodness. I almost, I almost fell on him. Um, she gave me a bunch of, like, tomatoes and zucchinis and uh, cucumbers and my beets back and i haven't gotten them in the ground yet i don't know actually i i threw i think i threw away the box so i think it's just random flowers i'm not quite sure babe i put some fish emulsion in some of my plants this morning as well to try and help it out oh but doesn't it look better than before when you when a basketball hit it because of somebody no, no, no. <laughs> Let's check out what the boys are doing outside. It's kind of funny. So I thought Power was teaching Uriah how to ride a bike. Because I heard I heard Power like instructing him on something. And then I heard like Uriah's little feet, like feet running, you know, hitting the floor. It's basically like pop, 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 pop. And then I was resting. I was laying down. And then... um I looked, I looked out and I saw this weird contraption. He is not, he is not learning to ride a bike. I don't know what this thing is. Set, go. Whoa. So it's a parachute to learn how to run? Oh, make you faster. Cause you want to keep it up. No, no, like there's just resistance. So something's pulling you back. Oh. Wow, look at you, runner. Interesting, interesting. Was that fun? You feel like you're becoming a better runner? Yeah? Whoa. Look for cars. Okay, run back this way. Oh, it came off. Okay. <laughs> It was, he was running off, so fast, it came off. Don't let it fly away. <laughs> PJ's it's turn. It's supposed to help you run. So tired. Where's the ball cap? On the floor. Yeah. Ready? Wait, wait, what do I do? Run as fast as you can. Ready? Set, go. <laughs> You ran so fast it came off. All right, the boys are still outside playing with that parachute thing. And I came back in because I'm like, you know what? Let me just do these strawberries because if I don't do them now, it's going to get later and later and I'm going to get lazier and lazier and it's just not going to get done. And the boys are going to be disappointed because I already told them I was going to do it. So, well, I did tell them maybe. I said probably. I think that's what I said anyways. So anyways, let me just cut up some of the chocolate. So still got this amount of chocolate left. Maybe we ate like half of the chocolate? Two, th no, half, a third, I don't know. But we, we ate a decent amount, okay, we did. And so I'm just gonna like break off a chunk, slice up or shave up the pieces put it in a little bowl, melt it, and then just start um, dipping my strawberries here. Well guys, this is all we have left. Pretty proud of the team. <laughs> this is definitely a team effort. Okay, so let me put this guy back over here. Get out of my way, and then I'm gonna start chopping these guys up. Actually, this chocolate is not like super hardened. Um, meaning it's a little, just ever so slightly, just a little bit melty, um, which is fine, I think. Give a little bowl. This is so interesting. So, like, before when I had it, and I would, like, cut it like this, it would almost, like, shave or break off. Now, right now, since it's a little melty, it's not really doing that. It's just actually like coming out in like chunks, you know what I'm saying? Not like shavings. But 
anyways, that's fine. I'll save a couple of extras for the boys. When they come back, they can have that. Little bits for the kids. Okay. Now we have to ever so carefully melt them in the microwave. I stand here and I literally watch it. And every like 15 seconds, I will give it a stir because I don't want to burn the chocolate. And it's so easy to do that in the microwave. Day one, parachute broken. Broken! Okay, open your mouth and you're vlogging. Take a light. Ay, ay, hold on, hold on. You didn't bite it like I said. Let me take this down. Is it good? Got three. Ready? This is where bite my hat it. went. Bite it. Oh, the stem. You ate the stem? <laughs> <laughs> she said bite it, not eat it. <laughs> okay, there you go. How is it? Mm. Good? 